On the latest episode of Joe Budden's podcast, <laughs> on Patreon only, he started a new tier. Um, he got into a weird argument about shock jocks being a racist term. And he talked about Howard Stern. So I'm going to play this, then give you my thoughts on it. But let's see what he had to say. All that shit, yo. Yeah. That's just what it is, but, you know, the game is the game. You're a controversial guy, I guess. So, it's going to get... Come on, you I hate that. <laughs> I hate that. You part. don't think you've been controversial? I have been. Oh, okay. My entire career. That's what I'm saying. But niggas just pussy. <laughs> okay. It ain't really been bad. You know? No, but again, if you if you the person that, that'll I potentially spark controversy... I ain't going to trial for nothing. There's no footage or nothing crazy out controversial. It's like... What Joe Budden has an opinion? That, uh, very okay. So Joe Budden has an opinion and a perspective that differs from people out there, and he talks about it a lot. It might not differ. He's just willing to stand on it and speak on it. Yeah, controversial. But I guess by definition, there you go. Yeah, that's it. We need more. We need more controversy. Controversy. No, no, he's not a shock jock. He is. The they label him a shock jock. The, the shock. Attaching him to a crazy You're a shock jock. Nah, he's not a shock jock. Even if I'm not, any Can't contract oh would God. be full of shock jock verbiage yeah. to protect the company and not the person they're signing. <laughs> you went from jock jams to shock jock. Yeah, yeah, shock and y'all know I think that shock jock is racist, but whatever. Come get me. Why was that racist? Because it is a term that I believe, before y'all get to attacking me, it's a term that only exists Shock jock is a term that only exists to put limitations and ceilings over black media people because of what they think and say on their platform. White people suffer no consequence from anything shock jock related. We just spoke about Joe Rogan, who do it every week. He weaponizes shock jockness, but he don't suffer the, the consequence that... Star has suffered, that fucking uh, Charlemagne has suffered, that I have suffered. Who else would they call a, a shock a shock jock? Wendy. Wendy. Who else? Like, there's, well, see, there's people that play play the game the Kevin Hart way, and there's people that play it the Dave Chappelle uncon way. Unconventional way. The Tyler Perry, the Oprah, the yeah, Queen. Yeah, yeah, the uh, Queen. Mm -hmm. But see, the reason why I, I couldn't say that was racist because... You always saw Howard Stern labeled as a shock jock. All the white, all the white guys were labeled. Like, I, thought, shock I thought it was twenty five years white ago. Term. I thought you were saying oh, well, that. Well, because Howard Stern is what I they miss. tried to call yeah, a shock jock. But what happened? What happened? They called him a shock jock. They tried to put certain limitations on him, and he sunk a radio station. Yeah, it was that, that was, it was powerful enough to yeah. do so. So where was where has the harm been? There's been a lot of media attention. But Howard Stern is a staple, has been, and will always be. Joe, I'm sure there were times where, and I watched the movie, I don't know how accurate it was. Mm. But I'm sure... And we don't even have to talk about Howard Stern, who has done all types of shit with I was just saying prostitutes the word, shock, and shock escorts and had him sit right here. Mm -hmm. Adam-22 doing a whole lot of shit that mm -hmm. no black person could do. I, like, I'm consistent in that point. Like, there's just different consequences so, so. for different people. I haven't seen the term... Shock jock negatively affect anyone white. And I double down on that. F effects that we could potentially see. Yeah. Because I'm sure it's been times when Howard Stern was damn. Joe Rogan just told Neil Young to suck his dick. Howard Stern has told radio yeah, stations was, to suck dick. But there were times Spotify pushed back at Joe Rogan right. and, and took episodes off. And um, he, I mean, it ain't been the same, but we said we haven't seen any pushback. Once you get to Fair a certain man, level. Byron Allen. Once you get to a certain level, you can tell him suck your dick too. Dave Chappelle is saying suck my dick. Once you get to a certain level and there's money, enough money behind you and not losing you, that's your leverage and you can tell them all suck your dick. Same way Netflix at said, one nah, point, we're not getting rid of Dave. You don't like it, don't watch. At Sorry. one point, Star was putting his dick on the table. Mm -hmm. I'm an avid Star fan and at one point, that nigga was putting his dick on the table. Bam, he was up there playing country music. Say, no, okay, he was saying the big. No, what I'm saying, I, I know 97. That. Welcome to this big Jew engine. Yeah, putting his dick on the table, my nigga. So I mean, I guess when you lose your leverage, or you only got a certain amount of leverage, and then they 
you got to put your chips on the table. But when you're talking $300 million, he got leverage. So and when you get to $300 million, now, if you want to get into... Hopefully, I'll be getting a couple of dollars. Many of us get to three hundred million. That's a little different, yeah. but I don't think. Yeah, but I don't think the term shock, 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 shock is racist, racist though. Term. I don't. Yeah, I can't ride with you on that one. I didn't ask you to. Okay. Well, I won't. I never asked nobody to. That's just the thing. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. And that wasn't written down. So no, no, no. I have what, to. what else? What what we got? We want to start. You want to start with the P Valley? I used to prefer that I says he misses P Valley. Uh, nigga, I want to go back to the pink. Yeah. I miss P Valley. Call me what you want. It's a great fucking show. All the other shows are coming back. I, I do not agree with Joe Budden at all. Shock jock. A racist term. Opie and Anthony were fired a bunch of times. Howard Stern was fired a bunch of times. And, uh, yeah, he became big enough. But remember, he kept getting fired and fired along the way and becoming big enough to where they couldn't mess with him. Such an odd take from Joe Budden. But he came out with that part of the show tier that I signed up for. And apparently, you get the sending questions or something. Might be cool, might not be cool, but we'll see what it's like. But, I mean... I've never heard anyone say shock jock is a racist term. It's kind of stunning to me. Pretty incredible. But uh, let me know your thoughts in the comments.